I think there's certain players that are timeless, you know, and George is one of those, you know, that uh, when you look back and the current players look back at the footage, you know, and particularly the ones probably in our squad who are, have Manchester United connections and that, you know, George's legend still lives on at Manchester United despite, you know, the, the fantastic players that they have, you know, produced and have come and gone since then. So, yeah, it is. I just think the whole story of George Best is one that, you know, captures the imagination of everyone and, as I say, it's, a, you know, a, a timeless legacy that he's left. For everyone in Northern Ireland, it was an awful day when he passed away. But uh, I'm just glad to have known him and glad to have been a teammate of his and played with him. And um, I'm very privileged to have carried his coffin uh, that day. It's hard to believe that it was uh, 10 years um, now, but the legacy that he, uh, he still holds here is, uh, is incredible. Um, a little bit before my time he was, but it, you know, I had the fortune of being here at his testimonial many years ago. I played with him in a testimonial and you know, he's somebody that everybody looked up to uh, over the years and, and obviously still do. It's actually interesting that it's come up to his anniversary just as Nolan Allen have qualified for their first major championships. And I know he would have been so proud of Nolan Allen to have qualified uh, once again for a major tournament. And, uh, you know, we, we miss him, but, um, you know, we, we've got some fantastic memories. We'll never forget him, that's for sure.